Welcome to this tutorial explaining how to do a property search on a specific chemical in eChem Portal. You first need to go to the substance search. The search by number is recommended. Nevertheless, you can also search by name and synonyms in several languages. You can select which database you want to search. On the result page, click on the number of hits found. On the next page, you will see the list of tests available in the databases you searched. The property search functionality is available only for a limited number of databases. Select the checkboxes to proceed with the property search. You can search physical chemical properties, environmental fate and pathway properties, ecotoxicological properties and toxicological properties. By selecting an endpoint, you open a query block. For example, we can select the partition coefficient. You can leave all the fields empty and proceed with the search, but then the data won't appear directly in the results table. We will enter a wide range to make sure we don't miss results. In the results table, you can see the data of the search field and if you want more information on the test, you can click on View Dataset. The data will be presented differently according to the database. As we have a large number of results, we might want to restrain it to reliable studies. You can modify your search criteria by going back to your query block. When we you specify several values in a field, they will be combined with an OR operator. When you specify several fields within a query block, they will be combined with an AND operator. You can also add several query blocks and create as many combinations as you want. In this result table, you can see both fields that we specified, the reliability and the partition coefficient. This results can be exported in an Excel sheet. Thank you for your attention.